Give it to him again. They're going to sling it back. Look at this gadget play. Wilson going deep for Curse. He's got it. Touchdown, Seattle. First down and 10 at the 46. And the pitch going to Lynch. And Lynch goes back. A flea flicker. And here is Wilson downfield. And this one is going to be caught by Golden Tate. And a gain of 44 yards to the 10. Toss the ball to Marshawn Lynch. He throws it backwards to Russell Wilson. And here comes Golden Tate. Going to act like he's blocking, does a great job selling it, and then gets across the field on what they call a cross-country route. The best opportunity to make the throw down the field. He'll take away those dominant pass rushers. Bertrand Berry, pretty tough coming off the edge. From the 44, free flicker, some trickery from Sean Payton. As Breeze fires downfield, and the catch is made by Devery Henderson for a Saints touchdown. Barry Collins in for Vince Young, who is the number two quarterback today. Please look at Penny airing it out. Hard one is down there. And brought down at the 25. Miami looking for a big play, and they go into the bag of tricks for it. Second and five now at the Atlanta 42. They're going to keep it on the ground with James. It's a flea flicker. Warner going to throw deep. Near side going for Fitz. He's in double coverage. It doesn't matter. He caught it anyway. Touchdown Cardinals. You can't stop that guy. I'm the flea flicker. Wow. What a play, and what a call by Todd Haley. You've been able to run the ball, so you hand it off to Edgerin James. He flips it back, and then the Japanese fighting fish, Larry Fitzgerald, deadly and single-minded of purpose, stabs the ball out of the air. Larry Fitzgerald led the NFL with 12 receiving touchdowns during the regular season. He catches his first postseason touchdown. Here's a little throwback to Warner going downfield for Fitzgerald. Covered by Demps and Fitzgerald makes the play for the touchdown. A penalty flag is down back in the area where Warner let it go. Personal foul, roughing the passer, number 97, late hit on the quarterback. Result of the play is a touchdown. And then he came back in, and, and I don't think for the rest of the half that he was the same. I mean, he may be recovering now, but he wasn't the same there for a while. 17 of 23 in the ballgame. Here's the toss back of Flea Flicker, and Jackson is wide open, and the catch is made. Touchdown. There is a flag in the backfield as well. The old flea flicker. And it's going to go against the Giants because Phil Sims was walking away. I don't know. The, the referee pointed the other way. Dick Hantak pointed the other way. But as he starts with the run, he has a wide open guy. Trace Armstrong went right for the knee on that one. It's, it's 53. Dante Jones it was. I'm sorry. He went right for Sims's knee. And Sims made some kind of throw. Yeah, personal foul on number 53 of the defense. It will be assessed after the kickoff. We have a touchdown. In a four on first down, they'll pitch it right back to Palmer and look into the end zone. And it is a touchdown for Larry Fitzgerald. But there is a penalty flag as there's a pushing and shoving and fighting going on. They're up 21-17, and then check out this bag of tricks. They snap it to Antoine Ramallel. He's going to throw it back to Ben. Ben on the left side. He's going to throw it down. Field a man wide open. And we've got a Pittsburgh Steelers touchdown. Wow. And Cedric Wilson. Whoa. What a great I... executed play by the Steelers. You had to be here at Paul Brown Stadium to witness it. Bengals just come undone in the fourth. We're seeing a twisted ankle. Here is the handoff from a cross to double reverse. And Fleet Flicker. Castle throwing. Here's Deshaun Goldson. He's looking in the backfield. They're going to threaten all this stuff to the perimeter and then watch Bo just run right by him. And they are running so good on the perimeter in the first half. Woodson is back. Teague is out. 
Robert Smith is back from Minnesota. And he is throwing it back to Cunningham, the old flea picker. And open is Randy Moss. And in the end zone is a Minnesota touchdown. Yep, you knew they were going to do it. The fans knew they were going to do it. The Dallas Cowboys knew they were going to do it. You knew they were going to do it early. Where Randall Cunningham just gets that ball and he just chucks it deep to Randy Moss. That was off a flea flicker. We saw Horn set up on the right side, and here's the pitch back to Breeze. But his deep man is covered, or is he? It's Horn. He's got it. And Horn will score. Oh, my. On second down, Deuce goes back on the flea flicker. Breeze waits, throws deep for Robert Beecham, and he holds on. A beautiful catch by Meacham at the 26-yard line. Win, a winning style. Here he is, pitching it back. Pitched it high to Roethlisberger. Unable to unload it, and it's caught at the 10. It's Heinz Ward slashing at the 5 and spinning down to the 1. Well, that was a really, really good job by Mewelde Ward. Nice fake. Roethlisberger getting away from pressure, and Heinz Ward selling the fake down the field. You're... 86, he's gone. What a job by Roethlisberger, and he's so wide open that Bob Sanders has to overrun the play trying to recover. Rivers has to play from behind. It's a four turnover day for the Chargers. They throw it back to Rivers. Nobody's open downfield, but he finds Benjamin, and he's got a first down inside the 20-yard line. Well, it definitely has a feel as though the Giants are up by a lot more points than what they are because they purely dominated that first half. A toss to Barber. Little trickery from the Giants. Toomer behind the defense. He's got him. Waiting for the pass and he's got it. Amani Toomer. Gibson can't bring him down. Touchdown Giants. 82 yards. Ron McLean and McGahee in the backfield. Again to the ground game. Now okay, he puts it back to Flacco, who throws a tight end screen. Todd, he's got all kind of room. 35, 30, 25. Wait for his blocker. 20, 15. And it'll be taken down just inside the 10 yard line by Michael Johnson. A 37 yard game. Wow. Welcome back to the offense, Todd Heath. I have seen it all. I have Cam seen Cameron. the pitch back uh -huh. pass where you're throwing it down the field, you fake the run, you go ahead, have the running back, throw it back to the quarterback, and throwing it deep. But that sets up a screen to Todd Heath, and Todd does an excellent job of leading or going down the field with his blockers leading the way. Takes it, pitches it back to Blennon, wide open in the end zone is Underwood, and that is a touchdown for Tampa Bay. Trickery delivered by the Buccaneers against the Saints. So the gift from San Diego, first and five. And the first play is Richardson, and a flea flicker back to Luck, looking to take a shot, Richie Lane. To the 40-yard line. And a pickup of 35 in front of the corner, Derek Cox. You got a great running back. Everybody's geared up to stop him on first and five. Let's hand him the ball and let's run a flea flicker. Great clear out by Darius Hayward Bay. And how about that throw by Andrew Luck? Bring it up! McGahee. Flea flicker. He's got Gordon! Touchdown, Browns! Jason Campbell with a strike, 39 yards on the gadget play. Yeah, I'll give offensive coordinator North Turner a lot of credit for that very uh, gutsy call. Giants with a first down on the Cardinal 30-yard line. Great field position. And they take a flea flicker, and Otis Anderson carries inside the 10-yard line. 20-yard gain by Anderson, Harvey, and Taylor on the stop. Anderson may have hurt himself on that play. He's heading to the sideline. I think that was a flea flicker. And I think Anderson, seeing that the quarterback was not in position, did that on his own. Made a big gain out of it. I don't think the play was designed for Anderson to go upfield with it. Watch him as he hits the line, turns back toward Hostetler here, and let's see if we can see what happened. Well, maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. We'll have to find out from the giant bench. But boy, that is a play. That's it, friend.